it's your Sarah's Kitchen again. Today I'm going to make tropical, tropical juice. Stay tuned to the end for the recipe. For the tropical juice, I have different types of fruits that I, I have here. I've already washed, they're clean. So I start by peeling my mango. You peel and then you cut into small cubes and blend. After this, I cut into small cubes. After cutting into cubes, take your banana also, cut into small pieces. The reason as to why I'm adding banana to the mango is to, to give it the natural sugar because because when i'm going to blend i'm not going to add any sugar next i'm going to peel my sweet pot sweet melon cut remove the seeds then you peel and cut into cubes the, like the way i did the mangoes Cut into cubes, ready to blend. I'll also add the banana like I did for the mango. The next one is avocado. I cut it into two and peel and cut into cubes. into cubes then I set aside next I'm going to cut my passion and scoop it careful you should be careful when cutting the passion because they are always slippery after this I just scoop off Do the same to the rest as you can see my fruits are ready now i'm going to blend one by one while blending i'm going to add milk which i have here i add milk just a little then i blend blend to a smooth and then you set aside let it chill in the fridge do the same to the next one and put it aside and then let it chill Just do the same, blend, put it aside, let it chill as you blend the next one. As you can see, my juice is ready. Now I want to serve it. I'm using a mug to serve it. Since I want to have a better presentation, I'm going to serve one by one. I start with the mango. Then I put my avocado. Then I put sweet melon.
after that I'm going to finish up with passion fruits. For the passion I'm just I, I, I didn't blend. I just beat with a spoon. Then I put on top. Passion is going to be like my garnish. This is my end result. It's a smooth tropical juice. As you sit down and enjoy, remember to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more recipes. Bon appetit!